Michael, go ahead. Hey, Caleb. Uh, Armando mentioned something uh, to this point. How would you compare your team's execution and quote unquote clutch moments uh, down the stretch from the beginning of the season until now? I feel like we definitely cleaned up a lot of stuff. Um, I think I feel like we're more solid uh, in late game situations and uh, we're not rattled at all. So um, down the stretch, uh, we're not worried about um, making mistakes or anything like that. And that final play, was that with the final layup that you had, was that a play called from Hubert or was that just Caleb go out there and get a bucket? Well, we didn't get the original play uh, executed. So um, I just took what the defense gave me and uh, went down here and scored the layup. Thank you. Patrick. Yeah, Caleb. Building off that, I mean, do you feel like late game execution for this team is becoming a strength and something you can really rely on uh, the rest of the season? Yeah, for sure. Like I said earlier, it's, it's, it's definitely been a, a great thing to see and a, a great thing to be in and a, be a part of because just knowing a late game situation that you're going to execute every time down on the defense and the offensive end. Andrew Jones. Caleb, how much did you guys have to dig down late, especially in order to close them out ten to three? Uh, just take those, take those, uh, take those threes away that they were hitting. Uh, they they did a lot of four and five high ball screens, and, and they were popping. So uh, they were kind of um, getting those, getting those open looks, and we tightened up our ball screen defense, and we took those away, and took uh, took away the drive, and then we gang rebounded, and and, and we got what we wanted on the offensive end. What was your vantage point of the uh, two passes that ended up with Brady feeding Armando for that big dunk late? What did you see? Say it again. On the play where I think RJ passed it to Brady and then oh, Brady yeah. fed it to Armando for the dunk, what was your vantage point on that? And what did you uh, see? It brought us a lot of momentum. Uh, just seeing seeing that play and, and it got the crowd into it and, and, and also um, it gave us some energy. Uh, to get a stop on the defensive end. So um, just plays like that shows how, how much we care about each other and how much we're willing to share the ball with each other. So uh, it was a great sight to see. Thank you. Isaiah. Hey, Caleb, how do you manage your energy throughout games? Do you kind of sacrifice on offense, maybe not moving around as much just so you can stay locked in as you are down the, down the stretch on the defensive end? Yeah, I, I mean, I, I got to – I gotta have energy anytime I'm on the court. Uh, you know, uh, we got this this four or five day stretch uh, where where we don't have a game until Saturday. So um, I'm gonna do a lot of resting and, and a lot of getting my body back back going. Uh, you know, playing 40 and 39 minutes is, is tough on on your body. So uh, just just being solid um, on the offensive end and then locking in on defense and kind of more preserving my energy on the offensive end, like you said. See, Caleb, you, you mentioned, you know, kind of being tough on the body. So what what do you take out of a weekend like this, the way the NCAA tournament is set up? You would be playing a game like Saturday and then having to turn around after one day off. Is, is there anything that you kind of uh, take from just a physical preparation standpoint you know, from from these two games that you think you guys can carry. Yeah, as far as in the game, uh, just not settling. Uh, you know, when you're tired, you 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 kind of not willing to to do the extra extra work to probably get a shot that we we all want. Um, and I think that's what I did. Uh, I, I kind of settled because I, I was tired. But uh, you know. Um, just being in that situation and, and going through it and feeling my body kind of getting tired, uh, just being more solid. And then on on off the court, just taking care of my body, just getting the right treatment with Doug and, and doing what I got to do. All right, we got time for two more with Caleb. Um, Adam and then Brendan. Caleb, along those same lines, like when do you feel it? And and how do you feel it? Like the the fatigue and and the you know the heavy minutes, you know, like when and how do you feel it when when you're out there? Um, it's just it's just uh going up and down, you know, a lot of a lot of fast break because you know we like to play play fast and just going up and down, legs get heavy, 
Um, but like I just get, I just lock in on my mental, and, it, and it's all, it's all in the mental. Uh, you know, just, just pushing yourself through, telling yourself keep going, and, and doing what you got to do to, to, to get this team to win. Thank you, man. Thanks, Caleb. Everybody sit tight. Um, we're working on Brady. Um, 